All right, boys, we are back with one side unity, one side pride. We're going to see which one is the best. You know, I'm biased. I keep saying that. I am honest with my biasness. My, uh, yeah, how, would you, how do you say that? Anyway, so I will admit that I am very biased towards side unity because there's a lot of hero cards. And, you know, Dark Magician cards are actually kind of cooler than Blue Eyes. Don't shoot me. Yeah, I'm not, you know, uh, I'm not into the dragons. So there's way too many dragons in Yu-Gi-Oh! At least Dark Magician, there's not that many magicians. And the artworks are pretty pretty, pretty cool. A anyway, so we're going to see what, what box has the better pulls. And I'm hoping... We get, you know, one of the alt arts, because that would make the opening a lot more interesting. But we shall see. Oh, man. Okay, so we're going to try to alternate packs to try to make it a little bit more fun and random. But we will see if I am actually able to do that, because I am. And I keep saying I am a lot. I'm not the best pack opener. So... All right, there we go. Unity, Pride, or starting with Pride or Unity. My bad. Also, the the uh, the Unity color is so much better. The purple over the blue. Come on, any day. Purple rain prints. Hell yeah. And I'm already struggling out here, man. All right, all right. Let's do it. Uh, I knocked it over. So, like I said, not the best pack opener, my guys. We got a um, Shadow Mist. Diver, we're starting off hero set, dude. Hero centric indeed. What is the last card here? All right, so we broke the pattern there. I, I don't think I've ever seen a pack where it was like three heroes back to back. So that is pretty decent. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Wait, so it's four per pack. I thought it was five. Okay, I think that's a galaxy card. We got a blue eyes card. Trade in. Hell yeah, and then a bird. The bird boy. Okay, so, yeah, I mean, let me know, too, in the comments. What do you prefer more? Because they did mix it up quite pretty pretty well, right? Like, we have Dark Magician on one side and Blue Eyes, and then we have Heroes on one side, and we have Black Wings on the other. We got Yubel on one side, and then we got, uh, oh, okay, we got the first, <laughs> first ulti here. That is pretty badass, actually. I don't know if you guys can see that. That is so cool, dude. This is going... Oh, dude, I'm showcasing this one for sure. That is amazing. This is why I love opening up this product. A. B. Why the hell is T the TCG not mimicking this product? This, is, this would have been a better uh, choice to import versus Rarity Collection. I, I love Rarity Collection. I love it, Konami. You should do it more often. But this would have been so much better to import, and you didn't. Or at least it seems like you're not going to. So that kind of sucks. Anyways, I do feel like that kind of... Uh, uh, Unity is kind of um, getting a win here. Limiter removal. Okay, okay. I see you. I see you. But uh, can it beat... Can Pride beat the uh, Princess Illusion Magician there that we just pulled? I don't know, man. I do not know. E, Emergency Call. And we got a... Oh, dude, that is badass. Hell yeah. You bell the ultimate nightmare as a secret rare. See, that's what I'm talking about. Ooh. All right. Pride, you got to pick it up because uh, it ain't looking good for you out here. We got a TG, a Drytron, and a, it is an ulti fusion. There's Cyber Dragons, and there's Blue Eyes that can be uh, ultis, and they're all, they're both light, so what is this? A, okay, hey, you know what, though? It's picking up, we're picking up steam here. There are two cards from the DM era. Pulled as alties and oh, that is pretty nice as well. The foiling, oh boy. Why can't we get alties like this? And do not tell me that the rarity collection alties are the same as the 
actual OCG alties because they are not. They just aren't. I'm sorry. They 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 tried, but they did not succeed. All right, we got malicious and a. I believe that's a solar recharge. All right, so pretty neck and neck, I would say, because uh, on one side we did get a blue eyes card, and on the other side we did get a dark magician card. Now if we've got a cyber dragon, and then a hero, that would be that would be pretty dope, actually. Uh, I'm having such a hard time with these packs. I'm trying not to ruin it as well, or ruin the the cards, because the pull tabs kind of they will ruin the the uh, the cards if you're not careful. Okay, okay. I'm also trying to build suspense here because I'm I don't know, man. Pride could take it, and I'm biased, like I said. Pride could take it. All right, let's see. TG Dragon Ravine. Overload Fusion, okay. I mean, I'll take it, actually. That's a pretty decent uh, Secret Rare. Some uh, some uh, Cyber Dragon action, for sure. Let's see. Ugh. There we go. And I think this is a Firewall Dragon, actually. Okay. It's Utopia, a Raid Raptor, and... A, yeah, I don't think that's anything here. Another Utopia? Okay. Okay. I feel like uh, we're due. There we go. Quarter Century Rare. I was going to say, we haven't pulled a Quarter Century Rare. Where are the Quarter Century Rare cards at? Medulce and a... It's another Fusion. And it is a Light Monster. So, could be a Cyber Dragon Monster. Or it could be another Blue Eyes. Uh, I don't know which one. I, I want more. Probably a Cyber Dragon Monster. Let's go for Cyber and Dragon. Okay. Okay. I see you. I see you, Kaiba. I see you. This is Tyrant. Uh, Blue Eyes Tyrant Dragon, I believe. I see you. Very Blue Eyes centric. It is fitting, though, because we are trying to see which uh, which pack is better. Is this another uh, quarter century right in here? We'll see. We shall see. I feel like it is, though. All right. And a... Yep. And it is a... An Effect Dark. I don't think it's a Dark Magician Girl, because I think the name is, like, way too long here. Let's see from the bottom. What is this? A... 1,000 Attack, 1,000 Defense. Okay. Okay. I feel like Pride is winning now. Pride did take... Take the lead just because I don't care about the Twilight uh, Princess or whatever the hell her name is. And the Blue Eyes um, cards that we did just pull are cooler than the uh, the waifu we pulled. But uh, we, we'll we see. It's still anyone's game here. It's still anyone's game. We still we still need two more alties. Two more all, uh, or sorry, one more ulti and then one more quarter century rare. So we'll see... Ancient Gear card IP. A Dark Magician. I haven't seen Dark Magician. I haven't pulled a Dark Magician in like any rarity from this uh, set. So that's pretty cool. And then a... Ooh, I forgot the name of this card. But it's a pretty decent card. It, it might be banned, actually. So, Pride is still winning. But me pulling that Dark Magician Alt Ultra, it's... Uh, it's Boating well, we shall. I'm gonna go with for the a unity side for sure. Okay, so this is not a card. I think that's cyber emergency. Okay. Okay. D hero angel, dark angel, I believe his name is. A dark ma magician circle or something like that. A fusion. Oh, Trinity. Trinity as an ulti would be pretty nice, actually. My boy. Not a lot of hero decks are using Trinity that much anymore. It's just the uh, the extra deck has... It's very limited, and there's so many good extra deck monsters. So, yeah, there. You gotta really choose what you want, basically. Triple Ds. We got uh, Lena, I believe, and... Okay, so this is the last ulti for, uh, for uh, Pride here. And it is a light effect monster. 
It might be a galaxy card. I feel like it's going to be a galaxy card. Oh, okay. I have no idea who this is, but the foiling looks, looks pretty badass, actually. That looks pretty... Yeah, see, these ultis just hit different. They have that texture uh, on the... Most of them, I should say, have textured uh, backgrounds. And that's not the same with the ultis we got. They are basically glorified gold rares. And that sucks. But uh, see, uh, ZS has sent the Sage of Dante and... Okay, no idea who this is. I feel like it's a Synchron, though. At least looks like a Synchron. So with that, uh, with that ulti being pulled, I feel like Pride kind of lost the edge a little bit. Because, I have, first of all, I have no idea who that card is. So, yes. And, of course, I'm being biased, guys. Yes, yes. Wait, Bonfire's in here? Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Bonfires, that's pretty crazy, actually. I wonder if people are buying this from the... Uh, you can't use it in the TCG, but still. And Thunder Dragon. You know what, though? Pride. Pride is kind of... With that pack, was it's pretty decent. Like They're not high rarity cards, but the fact that they put Bonfire and a reprint for the, uh, the OG Thunder Dragon is pretty nice. We got uh, Plasma. Okay, we got the last quarter cent. Oh, no, this is the ulti, and it's a spell. Some hero card, please. Gear Town. Ooh. Hate to see it. I feel like Pride is going to win. And I, again, I am biased, but I cannot. I'm not blind, you know? So, yes, that dragon actually looks kind of cool. No idea what, what archetype that's from, though. Triple D's and a uh, cyber recycling plant or something like that. All right, all right. So we need uh, the last quarter century rare from each side. And we got a dusted gold. We got a cross crusader and a... Uh, I forgot her name, but a pretty decent card meta wise but uh, we ain't we ain't necessarily going for meta we're just going for like you know cool shit triple d's we got the fusion the new fusion for the the blue eyes boys and uh thunder dragon okay another thunder dragon i'm not the biggest fan of thunder dragons the only reason i'm like i like the the thunder dragon pull that we just got in pride uh, because it is the OG Thunder Dragon, basically. And also looks really nice in, in a secret rare. I don't know why we're not, we haven't gotten it as a secret rare in the uh, TCG. Dark Hole, okay, okay, and a... Oh, okay, Judgment Dragon, that ain't bad, that ain't bad. But I'm, I'm not a, uh, I'm not a, what's it called, uh, Light Swarm player, never was. Never really liked them, so it doesn't... You know, it doesn't sway me anyway. We have the last quarter century rare in here as well, and a super rare Thunder Dragon, which looks awesome as well. Damn, dude. Okay, so it is going to be an effect light monster. I feel like it's going to be a galaxy card, but I was wrong before. And it is a galaxy card, actually. Photon. Ugh, I forgot the name, but uh, you know what? Unity can still take this. If we get a really good hero card i will give it to unity because i'm biased like i said <laughs> i keep saying that but hey man heroes trump uh galaxy cards 100 percent. okay so uh, it's a spell there are all to art spells so let's see ah uh, life's worn unfortunate you know we still got some packs here, but I do feel like Pride took it. We, we're done pulling all the higher rarity stuff, and I feel like Pride kind of had better pulls. Bingo Machine Go, Galaxy Card. But, uh, of course, also let me know in the comments. I feel like a lot more people are in the same boat as I am, that they enjoy Unity a lot more because it has more uh, like better cards. I owe... I, I, I shouldn't say I always see it because I have seen 
some packs that doesn't follow this trend. But if you if I see a malicious on the first as the first card, there's always a liquid boy as the second card. Really weird, but I kind of like it at the same time. All right, so last uh, last one here. Okay, one more pack each. Let's go. Can can Unity take it? Kind of doubt. Kind of doubt it. Honestly, there's nothing really cool that I can pull here. Okay, that's pretty. That's pretty cool, but <laughs> it won't sway me either way. We got uh, the new Destiny hero or new wish, new enough, I suppose. It's been uh, out for like two years though. So, all right, Pride, what you got? What you got for me? We got a Galaxy uh, Warrior, whatever the hell's the name is. Another Thunder Dragon. Okay, and a Drytron. So, okay. Yes, actually, a lot. We started off pretty strong, and then I feel like we kind of fell pretty hard in both cases, in both side and unity. But, uh, I mean, I will take it because this card looks really badass. I really do think I'm going to actually showcase this one. And I'm not even a waifu guy, like I swear. But the the foiling on that, that little wave effect, really nice. I, I think it looks a little bit better than the Cyber uh, Burst Dragon, in my opinion. But in the end, we got a, a lot better cards in Pride compared to... Uh, to, to unity so let me know what you guys thought who won this uh, little competition and i'll catch you guys in the next one